Stars, Apple has removed Andrew Tate's app from the App Store amid misogyny and pyramid scheme claims. Wait till you hear how expensive this app was. Andrew Tate developed, quote, the real world portal, a paid software that provided online education and a community on a variety of topics, including finance, after his quote, Hustlers University platform was shut down. And we know what kind of hustling he was trying to get up to, allegedly. In my opinion, the Real World Portal app developed by Andrew Tate has been removed from the App Store because of allegations that it promoted misogyny and may have been an actual pyramid scheme, like a Ponzi scheme, like Susu Circle, so many BS financial things that people promise, oh, give me this amount of money and you'll get back so many times that amount and it's fraud. Don't, if anyone you know from work asks you to do anything like that, don't do it. Tate developed the Real World Portal, a paid software that provided online education and a community on a variety of topics. And now... This is his, I guess, second platform that was shut down. The app, which costs $50, $49.99, right? 40 pounds, right? So I guess 40 pounds is $50. That just gives you an idea of the exchange rate, you know, with the UK. Uh, $50. Oh, no, it's not even $50. It's $50 a month or 40 pounds a month. A month? What? This is after that $8,000 a year membership thing he was he had going. Wow. And the irony is as much as they were trying to, you know, put women on the on the sales and other block, right? He's taking all these dudes money, selling them a system when all it's doing is lining his pocket. Wow, $50. How much money did this character make from this thing? <gasps> Mm. The app, which costs $49.99, 40 pounds per month, and was targeted towards young men, of course, preying on the young and naive, was taken down from Apple's App Store on Friday. It had already been taken down from the Google Play Store. And we know these are the same places that young men go to get things like gaming. We've talked about the whole alt-right pipeline from gaming. And here's this guy sitting at the bottom of the murky lake like a catfish, right? Just waiting, waiting to try to deprive people of their funds and sell them a dream, a dream that won't ever come true. But yet their pockets are that much lighter. $50? Wow! I've heard about premium corn, but I did not know about old Andrew Tate and his magical online realms and apps. Wow. Apple informed The Guardian that it had obtained a letter from McHugh, Jury, and Partners on behalf of four British women who had accused Tate of smegual and physical assault. The clients of the company were described as being, quote, extremely concerned in the letter dated September 15th regarding the app's entry into the App Store. Part of the letter stated... In continuing to host RWP, not only is Apple potentially indirectly financing Tate's alleged criminal activities, but is aiding the spread of his misogynistic teachings, unquote. Tate is being sued in civil court by four women in their late 20s and early 30s for alleged misdeeds that allegedly occurred between 2013 and 2016 when he was still a resident of the U.K., Attorney Matt Jury said Tate and his brother Tristan, quote, manipulate their sizable online following to promote subscriptions to real world portal before the app was taken down from the app store. From there, the advantages for users completely depend on whether new subscribers sign up for the platform. (gasps) Pyramid scheme, MLM, Ponzi scheme, Bernie Madoff. (gasps) Wow! According to the jury, the app, quote, is nothing more than an exploitative app that has no place on Apple's platform, unquote. And there is, quote, significant evidence, unquote, that it specifically targeted adolescent males. Hide your children! Hide your wife! 
Andrew Tate coming for the coins. A spokesperson for Andrew Tate, get this, said, quote, we unequivocally deny the allegations that the real world app operates as a pyramid scheme or perpetuates harmful techniques aimed at exploiting any individuals, particularly women. Quote, the user community, which includes a significant number of women, really, within the 200,000 strong user base, can attest to the positive impact and educational value the app provides. Well, I'd be curious to know what that educational value is, unless it's about exploiting other people. We know that women can be involved in 304 and 16 work. I've seen it. In Romania, Andrew Tate, along with his brother Tristan, are currently awaiting trial on allegations of human schmafficking. Both have denied the allegations. Well, they're going to deny it, right? Most of the people who go to court say not guilty. I didn't do it. Hoping to get off on a technicality. Look at our friend, (laughs) our five foot three friend in prison. You know, crying and whining. Our little friend Daystar, otherwise known as Tory Lanez, he's scared for his life. Well, all you had to do was not uh, jeopardize Megan's toes. All you had to do was calm down. All you had to do was keep quiet because she ain't want to bring it to court. Out of love and support for him as a black man. But people push it to the fullest extent. They they wanna they wanna just keep trying it and putting people's names in songs and sending hate trains after them, and when they get consequences, they boo hoo hooing. Boo hoo hoo isn't gonna mean anything to a cellmate, a gang, people who want you to pay rent while you're on the inside. And I imagine Andrew Tate and his brother Tristan are learning that exact lesson over there in the Romanian cell block. <laughs> Let me know what you think. Did you pay $50 a month for this app? My goodness. Oh, my goodness. I'd be mad if I had to pay that for a parking spot. I'd be mad if I had to pay that for a subscription box. But for an app, how much time can you spend on that app? Oh, they better get it, be getting me A grades in graduate school and writing my term papers for $50 a month. I'm I'm heated. Over the price tag alone, how much money did this character make? Can people sue and get their money back? I hope so. Wow. Ooh, what a hustler.